Ethan, congratulations. Thank oh, you so much. Really. You, 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 you're not deaf, dumb and blind. You'll be hearing the kind of response to it so far and it's been overwhelmingly positive. The people that love the musical, the people that just love movies, it seems to be ticking a lot of boxes. Uh, how much of a relief is this to you or were you guys full of confidence throughout this entire process? No, it's a funny thing. It's a little bit of both. And I think that there, there's some confidence that's inspired by John, who's right here. Uh, and his, his leadership was just amazing throughout. And I think, you know, when I first saw the movie, I went in with slightly high expectations because the experience of making it was so beautiful. I saw the work of all these incredible actors right in front of me. And so I, I felt, I mean, it was a real privilege to witness that on set. And then when I actually saw the finished product of the movie, I was like, I, I think it's better than I thought it would be even. Because um, he and Myron, who edited it, and, and you know, the, the entire team, you know, it's just like beautifully done. And uh, you know what, I've lost track of what the original question is, other than I'm so proud to be a part of it. And I feel, I feel really uh, grateful that the world's not getting to see it. Well, for someone who lost track, that was a perfect answer oh, to the really? question. Congratulations Good. for that as well. Thank you so much. I read an interview with you today, and you <laughs> were talking about the kind of the process of casting and how you like you played like multiple characters as you like to put yourself on tape for this. You wanted this like so badly. How just talk me through that experience of of getting the role, and then how has it lived up to all those expectations from a creative standpoint? Wow. Well, look, it's like a dream to to be in to be in Wicked the film, something that's been like circling in the air for a decade, a show that's been around for 20 plus years. That was like one of my intros to musical theater, one of my intros to theater and, and uh, had meant so much to me. So first of all, I, there was, I knew there was no chance I would ever get this role ever in a million years. I wanted it too much, you know? That was like the feeling. So actually getting it, it was just uh, surreal. And, I, and it's the kind of thing where I was like, maybe tomorrow it'll sink in, you know? Maybe tomorrow I'll, like, it'll settle in that like this is actually happening. And I've got to ask, they do say in entertainment, don't work with uh, children or animals, but how is it with the other half when you're on set with your partner? Is that kind of like, because me and my partner, we like to argue a lot. That's, just, that's our thing. So when you guys are on there, do you just like give each other lots of space or are you kind of trying to chew things up creatively, uh, giving advice and, and ideas or what? Well, it's not quite like that, but uh, Ariana's an amazing actor and she is like such an incredible scene partner with everyone. And I think that was something that was really special to witness. She and Cynthia together, but also the way that they interacted with all of us. Uh, so I learned a lot from them on set and I was kind of just grateful to be there and, and witness it. Um, but yeah, they're just both amazing actors and they're amazing actors to work with, so it's easy. Well, congratulations, buddy. Can't wait for the next one in 12 months' time. We'll see you then. Thank Hopefully, you so much. I can't slightly wait. Slightly drier day. I don't know. I kind of love it.